Recently, South Dakota's attorney general reminded people to be alert for scammers when you're contacted by phone or email. Our Humberto Haley Sanchez has some tips on what you can do to keep from becoming a victim. In 2022, the Federal Trade Commission documented 2.4 million fraud reports. That's down from 2021, but the kicker, more money was stolen from the people who did end up getting scammed. About $8.8 .8 billion compared to $6.7 billion in 2021. The main reason for these scams, those imposter calls impersonating banks, government agencies, or local businesses. Protecting yourself from these calls can be as easy as being wary of calls that promise a big reward for as little as a simple gift card, a payment via wire transfer, or other payment apps, for example, Venmo, Zelle, or Cash App. Something else that you can do to help vet scam callers is to ask the caller for more information about the company they supposedly work for, asking their name, the official phone number of the company, and what exactly the report said. In addition, if the number that is calling you sounds like a robot and is asking you to press a button before getting support, don't. Just hang up. Similarly to not pressing a button for support if you do not recognize the phone number or if your phone is marking the call as unknown or telemarketer, just let it go to voicemail. Remember, if you ever receive one of these calls, you are encouraged to contact the South Dakota Division of Consumer Protection using their email, or you can call them at 1-800-300-1986 or 605-773-4400. Helping keep you safe, I'm Humberto Giles Sanchez.